Hey guys, welcome to vtshikademy.com and here in this presentation we are going to discuss about transitive relation. So here first we are going to revise the concept of transitive relation and then we are going to solve few examples on transitive relation. So here if R is a relation in A then if A comma B belongs to R and B comma C belongs to R implies A comma C also belongs to R then R is said to be a transitive relation. And now let me explain this concept with the help of an example. So here we have the example as R is a relation in A 1, 2, 3 and 4. So now let us write the set of order pairs of R as 2, 2, 1, 1, 3, 2, 2, 3 and 3, 3. So here if R is a transitive relation then it must satisfy the condition if A comma B belongs to R and B comma C belongs to R implies A comma C must belong to R. So first let us compare A comma B and B comma C with the order pairs 3 comma 2 and 2 comma 3. So here if 3 comma 2 and 2 comma 3 belongs to R then A comma C which is nothing but 3 comma 3 must also belongs to R. So here we have the order pair 3 comma 3 in the set R. So we call R is a transitive relation. Now let us consider another example. So here we have R is a relation in the set A 1 comma 2 comma 3 comma 4. So let us write the order pairs of R as 1 comma 2, 2 comma 3 and 3 comma 4. So here to be a transitive relation R must satisfy the condition if A comma B belongs to R and B comma C belongs to R implies A comma C also belongs to R. So here R is not satisfying this condition as the second and third order pair here we have as 2 comma 3 and 3 comma 4 but there is no order pair of 2 comma 4 in the set R. So we call R is not a transitive relation. So this was a basic introduction on transitive relation. Hope you understood the concept. Do like and subscribe to vtshakademy.com. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.